<sighs> Day 79. We still don't have the voices. You need to bring the substrary to the sector. Unfortunately, the only way through is the big chamber because lower tunnel is flooded. Go immediately. Oh, joy. Oh, man. Wait. Oh, okay, no, I do have my assault rifle and stuff, okay. Uh, okay, that's how I holster. I forgot how to holster. I decided to take a break from this, uh, so I could see whether or not the vo that an update would come in and the voices would be added. That didn't happen. I know that the update said that you now carry your ammunition with you through the levels, I think, but, uh, I'm pretty low on munitions right now, so hopefully I don't die immediately. I have no clue what to expect. The big chamber. Oh, boy. Joy, 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 joy. Okay. I'm gonna stand back in case there's something on the elevator. Okay. Nothing came. It would suck if something blew through that wall. But, you never know. Okay, put my back to this. That goes that way. Why did I just look down? I heard that thud effect, but, uh... Maybe it was just my cursor. Okay, I'm, I'm still paranoid about just falling down to my death. Uh, okay, I have a supply closet. Uh, what? Okay, that was a lot easier than expected. I'm, I, I don't honestly want to risk that, so I'm going to go this way, and I'm going to go back the other way real quick. This is really weird. Normally something would either be at least in vicinity or I'd notice something by now is off. There's no abnormality so far, and this is concerning to me. Okay, so here's my first obstruction. The big chamber. Door sealed. Okay, I need to get power going. So I did have to go the other way. Good to know. I'm glad I checked first. It gives me some semblance of sanity. Did I just see something down there? Or is that just me? I did not mean to hit that, I meant to pull that out. Because this is just faster than taking this freaking ladder. And plus it's safer, at least in my mind. Don't know why I did that. Plus I can also shoot. What is with my leg? This is really concerning to me. Something significant. Oh, I see the chamber corner. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Mm, boy, oh boy, oh boy, this is gonna suck, I know that much for certain. God, so many alarm bells are just going off in my head that I'm gonna have to deal with something massive here in a second. Because the, the title alone, The Big Chamber, gives it away that, yeah, there might be something pretty massive, at least some kind of cohesive, just inherent conglomerate of mass, or some huge creature. One of the two. And I know I'm probably gonna be fighting it here in the next couple minutes. If not, maybe less than the next 30 seconds. I don't know. All I know is I'm ready for war. I guess since I hit the button, it still retained the signal that I pushed it. Oh, this is concerning. Okay. I think that way. H2051. What is that? Is that a fossil? I'm really concerned that's gonna, like, explode out of the wall. I guess nothing happened with that. Warning. Oh. Checkpoint. Oh. Infestation has happened. Oh, that's one of those radioactive crystal things. Can I hit that over there? No. Actually, no. That would be a terrible idea. Uh... You know what, let's do a scan ball. Is it B? Yes, okay, I do remember the control for that. Let's see, what is it I'm contending with here? Holy cow, this room is huge. This is a massive room. Where is my end objective? I just walked forward a bit. Wow, that's where I gotta go. Okay. Uh, let's scan down now.
This place is enormous. Oh, well, here's my first enemy I've spotted so far. Okay, so there are enemies down here. Huh. I think I have to go down and then wrap around. Oh, that's just dandy. If I remember right, it's this key? Yes. No, that is the scanner. B? No, I just threw a scan ball. Whoops. Might as well use it. So there aren't any enemies in the middle. Never mind. No one's wandering over. Okay, yeah, so I definitely have to probably traverse going down that lower section because I'm not seeing an easy means of getting over. God, this is just a massive wandering puzzle. What is it to drop rope? Oh, okay, that button. So it should be this. Or not. Am I not gonna put down rope or not? There, man, why was that so finicky? Will I grab that? Okay, good. Because I'm guessing this is a one-way trip, so it doesn't really matter, so I might as well go down. Oh, this is going to be a steep fall. I'm dead. Well, I knew this was going to happen, but I at least wanted to tr test it. Okay, so that is not the way to go. That little bugger's here, though. I might be able to make this jump. Okay. Oh, God, no. Okay, no, I can't make that jump. Hi, again. Oh, no, I landed on a worm. I thought I just killed something on my way down. Okay, so I can't make that second jump, I don't think. Not without a running start, maybe. This one, I can do it without a running start. Ooh, that was really close. Let's try it. Oh! Nope, I don't grab. Okay, that's good to know. Wait, what? Ow! I'm infinitely falling and dying on this bug. Pretty sure this isn't supposed to happen. <laughs> Normally I'd be pissed off at all my deaths, but honestly I can't help but laugh right now. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, this is supposed to be you. Yep. Okay. Hmm. Thinking right there. I'm not sure. Were you the one I was stuck on? I'm not sure. Okay, so I'm thinking my best bet is probably going down because swinging is not the best choice here. There we go. Okay, let's go over here. Man, my neck. Ow, my neck. Okay, there we go. I got a little bit more moment. I'm not. I'm killing my momentum. Okay, now go forwards. Wait, whoops. Oh, that doesn't help that I keep spinning around. Okay, let's just reel in and shorten the slack so that gets all this momentum out of the line. Okay, there we go. Let's swing a little. Counteract the swinging. Uh oh. God, it's always a pain in the ass, right? When they're directly below you because of how your character pivots. Okay, now let's try not to screw this up. This is really simple, just don't want to screw up the momentum, but with how much line you have out, it really works against you. God, it just does not want to cooperate. Huh, I could go lower than expected. I didn't think I, I thought I was at my limit by now. Oh, huh, okay. Okay, let's try this. God, this line does not want to cooperate. Risk it! Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. This, I should be able to drop a rope and make it. At least I would assume. Okay. 
Okay, cool. There was enough rope. Okay, we are making progress. Slow progress, but progress nonetheless. I was concerned I wasn't going to make that jump. Okay, from here, I think I have to scale up. I can't scale up that way anymore because of that rock. Get shit out its worm. I'm gonna have to scale down. It should be safe for now, because it's going the opposite direction. So I'm gonna take my chance and move. It'll probably try and drop down on me, but that's fine. If I grab the rope, which I'm not wanting to grab it... There we go. Man, that was finicky. Okay. It's annoying you can't grab the rope and climb back up, but in the same token, I can't really complain all that much. Question is, is there something big down here? A lot of enemies, though. No way you're not going to see me. I'll just summon you now. Damn, I suck. Oh, can't scale that shocker there. Uh, I don't think there's anything for me to shoot. Maybe I can get up here, crawl through there, up there, on this ridge up above me. And I can use that as a means of making a zip line. Maybe, I don't know. We'll see. Uh... Look at the draw. Nope, nothing hit. That landed, but I don't think that hit where I wanted. I can at least get a better view of what it is I'm working with up here. Yeah, no, that's nowhere close. This terrain is not very even, so it bugs out the character. I think it actually lost interest there for a second. Hmm. Maybe I can work with it like this. Or my character will be stupid. I'm actually stuck in the terrain. There we go. Okay, so I don't think I can get up this, actually. Could be wrong. There we go. Damn. Damn it. There we go. Deals with you. Okay. Uh, hmm. I think I have to go back up the way I tried going initially, but I have to get around that radioactive rock. So I've got to risk it and just go past it really fast, I can only assume. But I don't think I can get back up there. So, I gotta go around the other way, I think. I know there's at least a couple worms running around, but I don't know where they're at fully. So let's see. I don't know if I can actually up there. Hmm. Maybe I can, but it's gonna be risky. I need to move forwards a little bit. Didn't land. Ah, uh, okay. Damn. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to succeed in doing this. Swinging's kind of out of the option, so... Well, actually, no, it's not, it's not entirely, but I gotta do it in such a way. Let's give it a shot, see if this works. This might work, but this might also kill me incredibly easily and quickly. Okay, I need to reel in just a bit more. I'm gonna hit the wall. Okay, there we go. Perfect arc. 
Too soon. Damn it. <laughs> oh, and it spawns me over here. How the hell am I gonna do this? Oh, you can make that. Cool. You gotta do it right at the last jump. Okay. <clears throat> well, I restarted because I was literally just stuck in an infinite loop there and I couldn't get out, so I just said screw it and restarted. That radioactive crystal will hurt me, to my knowledge. <clears throat> okay, there's nothing I can land up there. I forget the entirety of the map, so... Let's just... Or don't pull out the scan ball! Hmm. Yeah, that's way too high of an elevation for me to hit anything up above me. So there's no point... Wait, what? There's actually a puzzle up here for something. Why are these up here? Huh, that's intriguing. There is no way I can scale this, though, so where the hell do I go? I'm not, still not sure, because I got stuck down there, and I couldn't figure out how to get to this. The only thing I can think of is setting up safety lines as I go, so that way I can interact with them later. Because otherwise I have no clue how the hell to get where I'm at. Because this, there is actually some space in between those two rocks there, but it's really difficult to reach them. Oh. God, this is a... For bloody sakes. How did you even notice me? How did that one over behind me notice me, but this one over here didn't? Whatever. Hmm. I'm confuzzled as to what to do. Because I don't know how to get up to that one. Oh, damn. This is a dilemma. Or just kill me. Thank you. Yes, I love you too, game. Well, we're getting back to the annoying BS again. God, this constant dropping and stopping me just because of a literally a couple of feet worth of a drop is so stupid. Hell, some of them are even inches. Fuck off! I am not in the mood for you. Yeah, I'd very much like to know how the hell to get out of here because I'm literally trapped down here. There is literally no means for me to escape. Nor a means of scaling up. How am I supposed to get out of here? Because there's literally no navigational means that I can see on the map that I can actually utilize right now. Not without restarting and going back up to, you know what? Load save point. Let's go to here. Screw it, that's fine. The only spot that I can think of that I can see... Oh, fuck. You know what? No, I'm not letting that happen. The only spot that I can see that was on the map was that middle section where you drop down before you get to the very bottom. It's the only thing I can think of. And you don't grab. I'm not dying anymore to this stupidity of this game just not wanting to grab or follow its own fucking functions. Ah, <sighs> this game just loves being a douchebag to me. I have died another 20 times just trying to get back to here. Come on, douche. Ah, this is aggravating. The only thing I can think of, which I can't literally get out of anywhere comparatively to the rest of the map, once I'm down below this section, I can't get out. The only area I can think of is literally right there. But I literally have no means of getting back out once I get to go down there to that section. Which is unfair as hell to the player. Oh, these aren't radioactive. They're just literally lights. God, I wish I'd known that. Oh, that is irritating. But whatever. Screw you! Yeah, there we go. That's too close to the ledge. So. Because last when I saw these things, these things were radioactive, and I didn't want to go near them. But I guess they're not radioactive, they're just floating. HOW DID I DIE FROM A FALL THAT FAR?! I WOULD NOT DIE FROM A FALL THAT FAR! I might stub my foot, but I wouldn't die! Yep, I knew that crystal was solid. <sighs> okay, at least I got on the line I wanted to be on. Oh, 
would have been royally pissed if I didn't get on there. Oh, you were there! God damn it, I'm so freaking blind by my own- You know what? No, you don't deserve to be my second death to this line. No, I'm loading checkpoints. Suck my fucking dick. You don't deserve that acknowledgement. Hey, dick cheese, I'm not letting you get the acknowledgement on me this time because I was blinded by rage. Fuck you. You don't deserve acknowledgement to be the second time I die to those things. I refuse to acknowledge that. And no, it didn't count since I didn't let the game fully kill me, so suck my dick. <sighs> Fucking little bitch. Seriously, there is literally no way to get to this section once you get down on that bottom floor below this. There's literally no way out. I've tried repeatedly, and I have literally no means of getting out of that freaking shit show of a bullshit situation. God, this has just been an aggravating session so far. That's why I got blinded and think of looking up. So I don't care, you don't deserve acknowledgement, and I'm not going to account it, nor did I let the game count it, so suck my ass, I never died to you. Especially since I loaded to a point where it didn't happen, so- oh, I don't care that I'm raging, shut the fuck up. At least I didn't slice my line. Okay, so now I'm up to this shit show puzzle section up here. Okay. Uh Seriously, right above me. I can never hit my target. Come on. I know you're there. Yeah, freaking prod me with your fucking rectal ass. He somehow hurts me. It's either 0 or 9, but I forget which button is the medkit specifically. I know I saw a lot of bugs when I first scanned up here. There we go, now I'm using the medkit. Does my character like to be an idiot? Let's see... Oh, there's nests up there. Great. Do I have to sprint jump all this? Can I skip some of this? You know what, can I save? Nope, I don't have the option to save. It only manually auto-saves. Great. Hopefully the character doesn't decide to stop sprinting mid-sprint. Okay. Mid-jump. Do not stop sprinting, you little frickin' weasel. Are you shitting me? Really? You can't seem to fucking figure that out? Seriously, why does the game not identify this and allow me to climb? Because I'm gonna fall. Oh, never mind, I did climb. I didn't think I would. Maybe the game's a little more ironed out than I thought. Maybe, but I don't give it credit for where it doesn't deserve yet. Because I've died to that so many damn times that I've tried before, and there's gonna be a coming a bug. Two of them. And they're right up on my pivot point. If I could aim... God, I'm bad. That doesn't help them one-handing it, so my aim is worse. Okay, should be clear for the moment. Great, more sprint jumping. I almost ran to my death. And once again, I didn't grab the ledge because this game doesn't know how to identify climbing. Well, at least I'm up here, but I'm just gonna continually die to these sort of instances purely because the game just wants to be an ass. Screw you, Latch. No, I'm not accepting that. I will die to that. Fine, I'll just use the ceiling. The game just wants to be a harlot. I should be able to sprint this one. Yeah. 
Why is this a burst fire now? Really? So now I'm just gonna wait. No, I'm not wasting bullets on that. Screw you. Can I switch fire modes with this? Because if I can't switch fire modes, this weapon has become ultimately useless to me. Oh, you can throw grenades now? You were actually given grenades. That would have been nice to know. Also, why can't you plant the bombs horizontally? You can only plant them down. Why? Was this gun too powerful for full auto? Did it break the game and make it too easy? It's called survival, and I need to use everything I have at my advantage. The fact that this got turned into a burst fire kind of kills it. It really defeat. I hate burst fire weapons, not only because you waste ammunition most of the time, especially on targets that it's not needed, but also the fact that it limits your survivability heavily. God, I will never not hate burst weapons. I'm gonna die to this. No, that was my own fault for not thinking that fully through, because again, I'm still pissed off and blinded by rage. Ah, yay, 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 yes! Okay. Ah, oh, this is annoying. I'm gonna die to this fall, aren't I? Yep, I died to this fall, so it doesn't fucking matter. I will not die to that fall! I know for a fact the human body can survive a fall like that. Oh, you're an asshole. Come here, you little... I'm surprised I hit that. How did I hit that again? God damn it. There, now I've landed. <sighs> Step back a little. Suck my fucking dick. At least this time I won't break my ankles or bruise my knees. Yes. Fucking hell. We gotta shoot, shoot the ceiling, I think, but these bastards are coming back. Come on, tongue Lars. See? Look. Waste of a bullet. Why did I waste that bullet? There's no need for this to be a burst fire. That's so impractical and illogical. That just literally does it so that this weapon isn't as effective, so you die easier. Yay, because unnecessary difficulty. It's called just make harder enemies. You don't need to make the weapons you give people weaker. Just make the enemies harder to kill. Ah, great, here comes Tongue. Come on, Tongue Tongue. You don't deserve the assault rifle. Ah, god, this is aggravating. And here comes another fucking bug. Screw yourself and your mother. Grab it! You freaking Oh, I hate you. Eat freaking ground. Hey, here's the spot I got stuck at, again. Holy crap, this game sucks ass at this. Yay, multiple deaths and attempts later, I finally freaking made it to this freaking horse shit. Just reel in so I don't hit the wall and die. Oh, I was reloading, that's why. Ah, oh, god, this stupidity just doesn't cease to amuse me. It just ceases to amaze me. How am I supposed to get down, by the way? Because once again, I'm stuck. And I'm trapped. So I might as well just die. This level is not laid out well. I understand difficulty, but this is beyond difficult. This is ridiculous, where you obviously got to do a specific way. God, this is annoying. I might as well not even do that. Because obviously dropping a rope won't be enough. I'll try anyways, but I know it won't work. Especially since I'm going to fall straight to a pit. So if I put a rope straight down, whee! And yes, I don't care that I'm pissed off. Bite me. 
this is annoying. This was not a very well laid out map. And I need a crank anyways? Where the fuck would I get a crank? Please elaborate to me where the fuck I would get a crank in all this. Where? Oh, this is aggravating. It's the closest I think I can hit without immediately dying. Or just continue to swing like a dipshit. Freaking limp tart. Okay, maybe lowering would be better. Respawn me already, shit fuck! Nope, that's too low. Oh, come on! That should have been enough for me to survive the impact! Bite me, you freaking asswipe! Yeah, because look, now I don't have enough line. Because I'll die! Because we! Fuck me! Just drop to your death. Just fuck me, right? Yeah, freaking look into the abyss as you contemplate your fucking shitty designer. Oh, hey, I actually counteracted it that time. I'm still gonna fall from to my death, though. I don't know, maybe I can weasel my little momentum a little bit and get on that higher-up platform. And maybe not fucking die this time! This is ridiculous, this map's layout. Seriously, it's so overly difficult. And I'm not just complaining. Because I'm upset. This is genuinely a bad design for this map. Because, man, it's so finicky and unreliant. It needs to be a bit more refined, and also, revert the gun back to a full auto. The thing I can think of is maybe trying this, but oh, look at that. My character's too inept to fucking do it right! Yes, eat the fucking concrete ground. Might as well be bedrock. That's my best chance. Look at that! It fucking worked! Hooray! I'm gonna die now, cause fuck me, right? Wee! Now watch, it's gonna s- oh no, it didn't actually, surprisingly. I'm doing that, so I can ensure that I get this here. There. I'm not jumping, cause bite me, this is too aggravating of a scenario. Really, game? Oh my god. This game just wants to keep being a dick to me. This game just loves me today. Okay, now to use the shitty ass no longer full auto, which would be grateful in this situation because it'll allow me to kill these guys better. But no, I've gotta waste my munitions like a freaking nunce. Uh, at least that's a button. Whenever I decide to climb down and not be a complete nutter numb nuts. I'm waiting for one of these creatures to pop out of these lockers. What's in the third? Nothing. It's just one aggravating problem after another. Don't get me wrong, it's not that I appreciate a challenge, because don't get me wrong, this was a challenging level, but holy crap, is it way too delicate and finicky with how the hell you do things. Man, that is annoying. I hate this new setting with this gun. Why can't I t If I could switch between full auto and, uh, burst, then I wouldn't have too big a problem with it. But nope, that ain't gonna happen. Yada yada yada, I honestly don't give a shit.